Grinding wheels, particularly those of the vitrified bond type, consist of thousands of grains of abrasive particles, which are stuck together and formed into various convenient shapes. These are then mounted onto precision spindles and rotated at high speed in order to remove metal, sometimes in very large amounts and sometimes very small amounts. Any one of these grains on the periphery of such a wheel could be travelling at the equivalent speed of an arrow being fired from a traditional longbow. You can understand then that any fragment or even a single grain leaving the wheel at this speed could cause serious damage to the human body. It's also important to understand that the manufacturer of a grinding wheel has a great responsibility to produce wheels that are sound and safe to use. Generally speaking, they do this, turning out thousands of wheels each year to a consistent quality. But no matter how careful the manufacturer is in the production of the wheel, they have very little control over their products once they have been delivered to the customer. If we, the consumer, do not handle, store, mount and maintain the wheel properly, we may be contributing to an unfortunate accident, which could inflict a painful and debilitating injury to ourselves or those around us. Probably the most serious accident involving a grinding wheel is when it explodes or bursts in use. As previously mentioned, the peripheral speed is such that if a wheel were to break, it would fly out in all directions, driven by the centrifugal force stored in the wheel. Let's see what this means when using a completely unguarded wheel. Now again, in slow motion. Anyone unfortunate enough to be standing in the vicinity of this would undoubtedly receive a nasty injury. However, this situation should never happen, as there are laws in force which require all grinding wheels to be effectively guarded with strong metal enclosures to minimize the extent of any wheel burst. Obviously, you can't completely enclose a wheel with a guard, as this would defeat the object of the grinding operation. But you must enclose it to the maximum amount possible and secure the guards in position before use.